So how do you grow Edelweiss without going to Switzerland? Now this journey has taken about eight months. It took us a long time just to get these starts going. First of all, look how small these seeds are. These things are as small as a mustard seed. To get them to sprout, you just sprinkle them on some nice fertile soil. Then we make sure they have plenty of sunlight and we spritz them with water every day. In Switzerland, you see these things growing out of the rocks. Maybe next year I will take some of these really small seeds and just throw them onto the rocks and see what happens. Of course, I know what'll happen. Because it's not in Switzerland, they won't grow. They somehow know that they're not in Switzerland. This Edelweiss is definitely revered in Switzerland. We've really wanted these to grow, so we've been babying these things. Maybe that's our problem, is we're babying them too much. Maybe we should just throw them on some rocks. We left one of them in the garage, and it is not happy. We wanted at least one of these plants to have a cold winter shock. And I would think if any plant needs a cold winter shock, it's this one. All the rest of them were babying in the window. These heads should get bright white. You can see they're getting a little bit white. Here's another little shoot. We were so excited when we saw this thing starting to form. Whenever I go to my parents for coffee, we always check on the Edelweiss. Sometimes there's only one way to learn and that's just do it. Here's that head when it just started coming out. There's no white fuzz on it right now. So we've been experimenting with each one just a little different. Different soils, different places around the yard. So now we've been able to get them to grow. Now we need to get them to flourish. So if you're just getting started growing these things, these are some of the things that we've done to get it to work. Now if you've got some tips on how to make these things grow better, please leave it in the comments down below. Well, I really appreciate your time and thanks for watching.